Look at this. Right, hang on. You know, I should write something on it. So then when he wakes up, he'll see it. Something like, next time you watch a film with me, don't fall asleep. I mean, it's not much of a compliment, is it? Though, blokes don't, do they? I mean, give your compliments until you've trained them up. Right, hang on a sec, I need a loo. Oh, and that's another thing. He leaves the toilet seat up. I mean, I don't know how many times I've told him. I mean, why should I have to get hold of a yucky toilet seat to put it down when he could have done it for me? But he is improving in other ways. Like, at the end of the night, he'll always say, Babe, how's your day been? Instead of moaning on about his own. Oh, and you know that really annoying thing that they do? When you're telling them something and they're going, Mmm, and they're actually looking at some other girl. Well, he doesn't do that anymore now. Not after I kicked him a few times. I know what to write. Oh, he's cute though, isn't he? You should have seen the state of him though when we first started to go out. I mean, he had no fashion sense. So I did try and drag him around the track centre. We just stood around sulking. Now I buy all of his clothes for him. Hang on a sec, I'm just going to make a cover. And that's another thing I had to put a stop to. Three sugars in his tea. I said, Jason, your teeth will rot. Plus, every night he would have to have chips. If he didn't have chips, as far as he was concerned, it wasn't a meal. I said, Jason, have you ever heard of a salad? Anyway, now he has like no sugar and he's only allowed chips twice a week. Which I make sure of, because I make all of his meals for him. Hang on. I buy all of his clothes for him and a cook for him. Oh my God, I'm turning into his mum. He's trained me up.